Hi. <laughs> can I, um, can I help you? Good afternoon. I'm Lieutenant Disher, San Francisco Police. I need to speak to Adrian Monk. Oh, uh, he's in the bathroom right now, wash, washing up. That would be Monk. Mm -hmm. I need to make sure that he gets these. It's very important. Ah, uh, sure. Are you, um, are you really a cop? Yes, I am. Oh, wow, look at that. Nice picture. Why'd you get rid of the mustache? My captain has a mustache. I shaved mine off so that people could tell us apart. Uh -huh. Sharona never told me she had a sister. Younger. How long have you known her for? Four years now. Really? And she never mentioned me at all? Well... She's obviously a little jealous. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Say, cop, are you like Italian food? Yeah. <laughs> Sir, are you ready for this? What is this, a game show? Can't you just walk in here and say what you have to say? The droplets on Willie Nelson's jacket, human blood from the victim. Well, he said that he leaned over the body. Maybe he got the blood on him then. The lab is 40% sure there's splatter marks from the actual shooting. 40%? What do you think? Well, I think it's not exactly through the hoop, is it? Okay, the blood is 40%. Videotape? 48%. Voice ID? 15%. Motive? 20. Well, that's like 123%. I mean, plus means an opportunity. Bring him in. What about liposuction? What? Liposuction, yeah. He he light put himself down to like, uh, I don't know, like 400 pounds. Down the elevator, across town, killed the judge. Or how did he gain all the weight back? Reverse liposuction. Oh, my God. Yeah. He just pumped it all back in. You think that's possible? I don't know. Should I call a doctor? <laughs> no. <laughs> Let's keep our reverse liposuction theory to ourselves, okay, Randy? <laughs> so what, he uh, leaves the house like uh, twice a week now? What kind of question is that? Hmm? He leaves the house all the time. He's not disabled. He just gets a little anxious about every single thing. Well, you know, the fact is, we're getting offers from all over the country, every day. I mean, I had to disconnect my phone. It was driving me crazy. Sure. The victim was stabbed. Yeah, that's right. How do you know he was stabbed? I mean, he, he could have been shot. No, you can smell gunpowder residue in a room this size for four days. You can? He can. And then the victim was strangled, too. Yeah. You wouldn't happen to know with what? Uh, phone cord. You can see it. It's, it's, it's stretched out. Oh, yeah. We, uh, we must miss that. You know, I dated a cop once. I still have his handcuffs on my bedpost. Well, then I should inform you you are still in possession of stolen property. <laughs> I might have to bring you down to the station. <laughs> Really? I might not mind that. Mm. Here, try this. Oh. Mm. <laughs> Too spicy? No, it's perfect. Oh, perfect. <laughs> uh, so, uh, what's it like having Adrian Monk as a house guest? Well, a few years ago, a squirrel got into the house, and I could hear it running through the attic and the walls. It took me two months to get rid of it. it drove me crazy. And? It's like that. So are you, um, you gonna wait for him? Monk. No, I can't. If he's washing up, he could still be another two or three hours. I should, uh... Could you make sure he gets this? Oh, of course. <laughs> uh, thanks for the, the sauce. sauce yes. <laughs> Lieutenant! I visited your clinic today and borrowed one of your empathy suits. Fat, but not heavy. Here's our invoice for the teal case. We like to get paid. Don't you usually just mail this in? 
We're in a rush. I'm a little short, huh? Yeah, so are you. Where's Sharona? She went to pick up her kid. All right, uh, Lieutenant, I'm officially handing Monk off to you. I want you to give him anything he needs. And quit screwing around and get back to work. Um, can we cut the windows loose? Yes. No, no, wait, wait. Uh, no. Uh, no, no, we better not. Sir, the building next door is a security camera. Maybe we could have a look at the tape. Yes, good idea. Talk to the owner. Wouldn't we need a court order for that? Right. I'll uh, take care of that later. Monk. What's the captain? He's getting an x-ray. He was in an accident. Is he okay? He, he fell off his motorcycle. That's all I know. Until he gets back, I'm in charge. Oh, my God. I'm so glad you're here. Monk, listen. This is big. In fact, this could be the big one. We have a suspect inside. It's Willie Nelson. The red-headed stranger? The press hasn't got wind of it yet, so just... Could, could I... Can I talk to him? You like Willie Nelson? Are you surprised? What? Yeah, it's just so... So normal. Well, he's inside and he is not talking to anyone until his lawyers get here. If you want, you can meet his road manager. Say hello to Sonny Cross. Hey, we found this on the front door uh, to lure him into the alley. What does the J stand for? His legal name was Jason Cross. Look at this. Shot one through the collarbone, shot two straight in the back while he was running away. We have a witness, Monk, who heard Willie Nelson and Cross arguing just before the shots were fired. We found the gun over there behind the dumpster. It's a Webley, a Mark I, a 38 caliber, no prints. An old Webley? Yeah, so we can rule out a mugging. I want him. Go, go! <laughs> San Francisco, you gotta love it. Heading south towards Prospect. Is there a description? He's wearing gray sneakers. Is there anything else? He's not Jewish. Come on. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good boys. <laughs> All right, hold it right there. Stop, stop. There we are. We got him. Oh. Oh. Streaker in custody. It's jungle out there. Disorder and confusion everywhere. No one seems to care. Well, I do. Hey, who's in charge here? It's jungle out there.